Right. Uh, please just start with the Frenchies. Welcome back, everyone. Part two. This horse, who I'm still on the fence about being revenge, is off. Bye bye to you. Uh, this big, fluffy, beautiful monster coming in. This will be a much easier idea. Famous last words. Let's see. Very, very distinctive. Look at this. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, the Radford S course. Enormous hooves. Right, let's grab this. I've got an idea which horse it is already. Indiana, everybody. We've got Indiana. Okay, uh, I might not be lucky in this, but I'm going to try and ask the trooper which two came off a moment ago. He might tell me, he might not. Uh, I don't recognise him, so it's 50-50 it's at best. But you know what? If I don't ask, I will never get. So, hey. Oh, you're, you're, way, you're way too kind. Way too kind. So I have moments of humour. I'm even training him now without people telling me. <laughs> oh. Second everyone. Let me let me see if I can find out. Trooper, can I ask you something off camera? Can I ask you something off camera? The camera's going that way. Um no. no? Okay, alright. Doesn't want to, doesn't want to, everybody. You heard it there, no, no, no. I did say I'd try. He's shy. I think the reason being some of the time is the new guys here uh, don't know, even though I said the camera's away and you saw it was, don't know if they're being filmed. So I can understand his caution. It makes sense, it's fair enough. And I have to respect it because it is his workplace. So we've still got a bit of confusion about the first two. I mean, I did call them and I'll stand by what I said, but you know how much I strive for absolute clarity, folks, especially when it comes to the names. <laughs> Let me pop Indiana into the list. I'm still pretty much sure we've got or had revenge in Shearer. So Indiana at the other end. Let me see in a moment which horse we've got this end. This one's very curious. I'll take a picture of you, so we have to get in the game. No, they're sort of pushing people out of the way. Oh, goodness me. It's like a nursery, kindergarten here. People are waiting, kind of queuing, because other than taking quite a lot of time. Monopolising the horse. And then the other people. <laughs> it's just chaos now. Everyone is just pushing in. Gosh, I wish I could step back a little bit, folks. I can't remember because there were too many people here, but look. The lady with the child on the on the bottom right of the frame was, was already waiting. Other people were just sort of squeezing in. Look. <laughs> okay, finally. Oh. <coughs> you know, some of you have mentioned about this kind of, you know, some of the people seem to assume it's a petting zoo. We've had that in the comments. Mornings like this, that is exactly how some people behave. I mean, look, look, they're just running over trying to push in. I've got no chance of even looking at the hoof number yet, so this one's going to stay a mystery for a moment. We'll go back to Indiana at some point. Wait, let's get a bit closer. Oh, 
probably the closest we've ever been, everyone. It's the only way to avoid lots of heads going along in front of the frame. I wish we could have been this time. Say, take Jim Smith, you give Veronica. The way to take for this picture, you will be that. Nie bukujmy, choć... at the uh, toys all this time as opposed to the horse's head. Notice that little star under the forelock, it's definitely Tipper. Don't even need to check. This is good because it's a playful horse, but this horse doesn't live. And on a day when there were this many children here, that's probably ideal. Oh, 
I mean, you know folks would generally like to be this close, but there's really not much of a choice this morning, at least until it dies down a bit, if it actually dies down a bit. <laughs> I hope you can actually hear anything I'm saying over the uh, cacophony of voices behind me. Big fluffy tipper. Hopefully not to me. <laughs> oh, where? <laughs> he's holding on to. Oh, God, I just noticed. Yeah, his fingers were jammed in there. Ask it out. Oh, and there it is. Didn't take long, did it? We had a week, folks, without a single hand. Uh, and thanks to that chap, it's now gone. I think, to be honest, they probably, even if Oman were available, Oman would have been a terrible choice for uh, for half term with so many school kids here. So I would actually, personally, I would guess the Blues have brought very passive non-nippy horses. Indiana at the other end, we'll go back to shortly, is a very chill horse. This one, Tipper, we've never seen him by anyone. He's an absolute big softy. Really kind and curious, but a softy. Because that would really be a... Yeah, it would really be a negative thing if, if a kid got bitten during half term. You just know they'd run to and national newspapers, we've seen that here before when people were pushed or bitten, etc. <laughs> Many times. I'm going to be the first one to play it smart and turn around because Tana they're back finally oh look at look at this one I was really starting to think where are they hiding the police horses and why but no folks they're back they've let them out right this end Indiana I'm moving away from the other end because there are at least six other people filming <coughs> and if I'm smart I can get to this end in a good spot before they decide to do so I 
<laughs> Didn't quite catch it. <laughs> I don't even know what he's doing. I did mention that guys at the weekend that we could expect madness. Uh, but obviously the weather's brought out far more people than would have been out ordinarily. It will not be like this tomorrow, thankfully, because <laughs> I won't be here tomorrow. Very rainy day forecast for tomorrow. Uh, it's pretty much certain. I'll pop this up as uh, as the first part. I mean, it'll, it'll be part two, but you know what I mean. It'll go up, uh, to be published first. Chaos here is just oh, okay. <laughs> She had a real fright. I don't know what scared that lady so much. Okay, Rose finishes selfie. He's up in a minute. Excuse me, please. There he is. Happiest tourist ever to visit horse bars on the left. <laughs> <laughs> Bro is delighted. God. Okay. Tourist of the Day award right there. Top man. Mira acá. Wow, pushing and shoving is crazy. Just look at it, guys. Look. <laughs> Unstoppable tour of tourists. Sort of last June vibes today, aren't we? <laughs> so, to be honest, folks, the yard is no less packed. Let's have a little wander in there. It looks equally jammed in the yard. And we're not anywhere close to there being a changeover yet. Puffer jackets in the house, people. I don't think yet we actually heard anybody getting shouted at from the front. That said, there's still plenty of time, like more than enough time. The main reason I'm thinking is that the chain in the centre is down, which is odd because we're nowhere near a changeover. It just happened 20 minutes ago. There you go. It's a torrent in here, constant, just like at the front. And the chain 
as I mentioned in the middle, is down. I'm not sure why it's down. It's ordinarily up just after the changeover is finished. I don't know, maybe they forgot. It is pretty busy. And again, regimental changeover this morning. Understandable if it's been overlooked. Still throngs coming through the tunnel. So many curious people and it's funny because despite the publicity this place gets we have to bear in mind that what zero 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 one percent of the world's population have ever been to horse guards in fact probably from less than that but you get where i'm going with this a teeny tiny percentage of a percentage of a percentage of people have ever even been to this place let alone watched a video about it so it's not really surprising how often it goes wrong uh and people don't know how to how to avoid getting in trouble shops doing a roaring trade as I mentioned earlier, it's pretty much guaranteed today. Sun comes out, tourists come out, wallets come out. Great for the British economy. A lot of people asking, why is this place so popular? It's unique, that's why. Where else do you get this many people? Fascinated by a horse. It's kind of rare that I'm at a loss in terms of where to stand, but it doesn't really make any difference because wherever I stand, uh, there are people in front. So we're always making their own little vlogs as well today. Constant bobbing of heads, guys, in the frame. Apologies, wait, that might be a little bit better. Temporarily. Pushing people, honestly. You know how patient I am, guys, but while the pushing behind me is really just constant shoving. Guard. Okay, I said they've uh, released all the police horses that were being held captive this weekend. Uh, just a couple of tourists here as well.
I think a single person has managed to get them just themselves uh, in the frame without any strangers. What can you say, eh? I mean, I'm barely speechless, but today I've forgotten just how crazy it can get here when the tourists come out in, in these kind of numbers. Chose well for this many people. Completely oblivious to how many tourists are on, how much noise there is as well. I mean, look, if the guard tries to come out of the gate, forget it. So they would head the other way uh, into the tunnel when it's this busy. Oh, did this guy forget there's a horse in front of him? He almost walked into the horse. Okay, so the guard is coming out. What does it mean? I don't know yet. Just at the way in time, look. 
A little bit more tolerable here in the middle. Like a real little bit. Make way! <laughs> oh, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he was there. He was absolutely shook. Even the guys laughing about it. <laughs> Good heavens! Just like what on earth, folks? <laughs> what the? Hey, wave the king's lifeguard. This is well. Okay, summer's back. <laughs> he was shook. That's what this is going to complain, I think. After that, goodness, wow. It's been a while since we saw something. Uh, <laughs> what's the word I'm looking for? Um, so precise. The execution of that by the guard was brilliant. Actually, wait, hold on. I, think I need to move back myself. What a top man. To be careful, actually, people with push shows and plans and all sorts uh, behind me. <laughs> I don't think there'll be a finer moment in the entire day, guys, other than that. I don't know how well that was picked up uh, until I look back through the footage, but it looked to me as though the guy, <laughs> the guy was clearly a bit vexed uh, about having been schooled that hard. Oops. I mean, to be fair, I wasn't even convinced the guard would come out. Um, it is very, very busy, and I do remember in the summer that often they would go to the tunnel instead. And I can understand why. They don't actually want to shout at anyone, I can tell you that, unequivocally. Not a single guard I've ever spoken to has said to me, you know what, it's my favourite part of the job. I love shouting at tourists. Never happened. Okay? They don't like to do it. They really don't. There's no pleasure in it, much as it might seem funny to us. They only do it if they're being impeded when they have to make their rounds. Fair enough. Okay, so back to happy tourists all dressed up for their pictures here at Horse Guards in the sunshine. Now I'm really hoping that what we saw in the last 30-40 minutes is going to calm down somewhat because that was a little bit too much even for me. The pushing behind me and shoving and uh, so on my rucksack was just, yeah, I could feel myself getting uh, somewhat flustered and thinking you know what I'm gonna have to tell, tell off someone in a minute they pull, pull me again but it's no one's fault you know it just, it just isn't enough space here physically um, and I see now it's kind of quietened but it hasn't actually look everyone's in the middle see it's no different absolutely rock solid chocolate packed okay let's focus on the Indiana for a bit a couple of the very well known uh, tall guys that have massive groups at the back. There's one. Do you want to come with me? However, luckily, uh, he seems to have lost the, uh, the loud hailer, which I see as being a huge positive, personally. I'm not sure actually if anyone called the fire brigade to come and clear up uh, the flood of tears that the Chinese tourists left. I don't understand why people sort of continue to take pictures when they've definitely got other people, strangers in the background. I mean, for me, the best part about half term week much like the summer holidays here is that as you could probably hear yes we've got hundreds of accents and many dozens of languages being spoken but at no point during the year do you ever hear ever hear 
as many British people here at Horse Guards as during this half term and then the Easter holidays. In the summer, so many kids go away, they go to Cornwall or Scotland or house in France or Italy or Spain or whatever. Even in the summer, you don't get a lot of British, uh, British people here. So enjoy it, everyone. Uh, yeah, this this half term week and Easter holidays, and then it's tourist season proper, i.e., international tourist season, it's the British tourist season. Thank you. Spend a bit more time with Tipper in a minute. I'm liking this end because the light is brilliant. It's really perfect for filming at this end. We definitely don't want to neglect Tipper. The good thing is that I can see from the length of the video so far that uh, we've got just over 20 minutes until they change over. to the standby low power mode. Maybe uh, somebody had let off something earlier, like one of these little, uh, I don't know what it's called, these little things that they drop on the floor. Even the trooper can't get through, look. I think I will stay outside for the changeover. 
a little look at Tipper. There's a huge crowd around Tipper. This is the problem. It's me feeling like a tourist right now, folks, more than ever. So we wait for this flood to move, otherwise, I've got zero chance of getting even close, let alone directly in front of the horse. It's too many people. That's a little better. <laughs> You've got food in your bag there. Hey, full tipper. Such a big soft hit as well. to move he might not he might go straight back in through the gate but my instinct is usually pretty accurate <laughs> it's always stress to the lifeguard refuses to move out the way <laughs> ah goodness Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm not sure what he said, but that sounded a bit like. <laughs> what your mouth then? I mean, to me, it looked like this. <laughs> no, this. I'm pretty sure he turned around there. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, goodness me. Any lip readers, folks, watching the video? What did the guard utter, or mutter, rather, or utter, actually uttered it, he didn't mutter it, he uttered it, uh, under his breath uh, when he turned around? I wouldn't blame him if, uh, if those were the words that he, uh, that he uttered or muttered or, or muttered. Mut, mut, mut <laughs> oh, goodness. German out and around in the centre here. So then today. You kind of understand why it's difficult for people to know, you know, when to go up, how to go up, if there's a queue, where it begins, where it ends, because, I mean, look at it. And the same behind me. Indiana could not care less, honestly. In fact, he's probably the most Radford-esque of all the horses in the blues. Look. Same feet, same, same socks, same everything. Again, folks, I'm not sure if you heard that, British people having a conversation there about whether or not you're allowed to touch the horse. You notice that people are touching the horse at the other end, and indeed, yeah, tip is getting a lot of attention. <laughs> I don't think uh, Indiana appreciated being prodded then. It's going so well. Well, uh, we'll finish this video at the changeover uh, with Tipper. If 
Ah, this space. Big gift. Thank you. Huge gift. somebody uh, suffered a trauma uh, of having their handbag munch but I guarantee it's going to happen one day Even though it is really busy, the horses I wouldn't say have been particularly mauled today. We saw a lot more of that over the weekend, with, with less people, curiously, than we've seen today. Yes, it's been a, a massive deluge, but overall... Overall, quite pleasurable, I have to say, folks. Even for me, watching and noticing that most people are giving the horse space. Uh, and not persisting. We've only had one person out of the, I don't know, how many people did we film today? Several thousand, I would think, at least. Only one person put their hand on the reins. Impressive. And unexpected. take home about a choice. Total no stress. There's my moment folks, I can escape or just about get through. I mean look at it. Today is real pickpockets paradise. I haven't seen or suspected that at all yet today, but it's surprising me if, uh, if some people are going home missing a few items. A little wander in the yard, then we'll come out and finish up in front of Tipper. They're just about to close the yard anyway. Oh, crime is being looked. How about that? I just. Yeah. Oh, not entirely certain what in fact he's done and why I think actually he's probably been pickpocketed just as I'm mentioning it how about that that's the first time I've actually ever seen the police here Ministry of Defence Police with their notepad open taking notes I mean I don't know maybe he did something naughty he definitely wasn't under arrest that chap I don't want to disparage him in any way uh, my money will be on him either having lost something or having uh, having been pickpocketed. Very unfortunate, but there we are. You can see from the body language between the, uh, the tourists and the police that it was nothing, nothing bad. Oh, I thought somebody was actually going to post a picture at the back of the horse then. That would be a first, wouldn't it? Police are just looking at the... Uh, at the time, other officers are coming out. Right, they're about to chuck everyone out. There we go, behind the line. Time. Coming up. Wow, so guys, you see this when the camera's sometimes moving, like jerking. It's because people are pushing past me. Like, really pushing past. 
Ah, uh, he's asking them whether there are cameras. So I, I guess he was uh, he was robbed, pickpocketed. Poor chap. I mean, it's happened to three people that I know that film here um, this year, so not very surprising. We know it goes on. At least if I get myself into a good spot in front of Tipper, folks. Is that light? Ah, no, the other side's better. Okay, this is where we need to be. Good to bar. That's it, perfect. Yeah, this is it. And we've got the entire horse in the frame. Right, here we go, ball out time. I have to clear everyone away from the other ball. Right behind the ball, Oz, please. No, no. The horse is going to move. Once it's moved, then you can do it. No nonsense, this officer. Excuse me. Uh, you've got to go that side. Pretty sure, just a wild guess. East of Scotland. <laughs> Same for them, and people are still posing. The other horse. Actually, a great thing that they're moving everybody way back. Someone definitely in the period between last autumn and uh, the new year beginning here, after the renovation work was complete, somebody definitely, uh, I think, had a word. One of the big bosses with the police said, "Right, just absolutely hammer on all of it. Really, really on it. We've seen this in the past six weeks, give or take. This year, absolutely on it with the crowd control." Taking no nonsense at all. Even a foot in front of the bars or people close to the box in the yard, they're just not having it. They're on it immediately now. And I see that's a huge positive. It's good for everyone. <coughs> one minute to one. Sorry, ran off so quick. There was the water bottle on the uh, on the gate behind the officer. Water, uh, white water bottle. <coughs> Yard is jammed. Look, completely full up. This is noon, folks. Change over. Uh, any of you have watched this part one from this morning uh, will likely be published either later today or. Uh, possibly tomorrow. Let's see how it goes. How clean the line is. See Tipper again on Wednesday morning. His ears moving as I say it. Tipper, look, he knows. There yeah, you do. <laughs> 
четыре. See if they're replacing this horse with the one that was here previously. Yes, it is the horse that was here previously. Remember those distinctive hoops? Now, before I leave shortly, I'm going to endeavour one final time to get a super, super close up of that hoof. Still actually the middle of the changeover, but hey, don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, right. Mm. Let's see. It's gonna get real busy. Let's see if we can get that food. How it's I'm still pretty sure I called it right the first time. I'm yeah, I'm still I'm still sticking with what I said before. Shira, 99.9% certain it's Shira. Oh, <laughs> hey, thank you. Yeah, that's a real close-up I got. There's a bit of muck on the second number, but yeah, it's Shira. It's definitely Shira. Changes still in progress inside. It's not going to end today. I think it's going to be like this until the end of uh, any day inspection of four. I really think it'll let up. It's warm, it's bright, it's sunny. I think in a moment when uh, when they finish change over, they've just actually done it. Relief going in. New gatesman. Fast numbers of people, look. I really was thinking it would maybe calm down a teeny bit, but it just doesn't look as though it will today, does it, at all? miscreant before we finish today <laughs> exceedingly unlikely but hey not impossible see wherever I point the camera today uh, the shot is is interesting That probably was the closest we we're going to get. It was, it was close, and even the trooper turned his head, but it wasn't close enough. Alas. But you know what? There's always another day. Yeah. Uh, I have a good look at the footage. Uh, that shout, right in the guy's face, that exceedingly loud shout. Um, I think what I've heard so far, that was one of the clearest, actually, if not the clearest. It was a very, very, very clear shout.
<laughs> this guy looks a bit vexed. He was like, I wanted to be there first. Wait, here, he's got his spot. Yikes. I really hope he's fast because that rucksack looks odd, very odd left on the corner there. Not only that, somebody could easily grab it and leave. Easily. I'm guessing it's probably not stuffed with 500 euro notes, but... Oh. I should mention we actually filmed the <laughs> theft live. No, 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 there's no line, uh, as you wish. <laughs> uh, that's cute. Are you in line for a photo? I'm not in the line, there is no line. Uh, it is an absolute 100% in every single aspect free for all. You know it here, there's no line, there's no sort of rhythm. It's all pretty much. How, how do we describe that? <laughs> as it comes, effectively. Goodness gracious, what a morning. Folks, uh, I'm off uh, for an ice bath couple of bottles of wine, <laughs> dark rum, uh, and maybe even some olives if, I feel, if I'm feeling rich, uh, which I'm not. Anyway, for myself and from... Oh, you know what? I already thought the name. That's Shippen and my Shira. That's it. Yeah, for myself and Shira, guys, we're out of here. Uh, back soon. Very soon. <laughs> Bye for now.